To create a recipe, you will first select the navigation panel and then select the sample setup screen. Here, you can select your sample parameters such as number of samples or infinite sampling. Next, you can choose the preferred sampling method such as time or volume. After this, we'll adjust settings for purges before samples and intersample delays. Finally, you can adjust units of measurements including cubic meters, cubic feet or liters, and set the data reporting to raw counts or normalized counts per unit of measure. After getting the desired settings, you will save the recipe and download it to the instrument. Here, a keyboard appears for you to name the recipe. Simply name the recipe and select OK. A notification that the recipe has been saved appears. To confirm the recipe, you will return to the navigation panel, select the recipe icon, and view the newly created recipe. Now, we will load the recipe, which will prompt a confirmation screen. Select OK. The recipe will then load to the unit. From here, you can also review the recipe that has been loaded by selecting this Recipe button. Here, the recipe will display for review. You can also print the recipe settings from this screen. To run the recipe, simply navigate to the home screen. Here you can again confirm the correct recipe has been loaded. Now to run the recipe, simply select the start sample icon to begin sampling. 